tonight we were supposed to stream anima but it's like it's like 9 30 in the evening and we're not going to get a lot done so i said you know what let's stream through a shorter game let's just let's just blast through a shorter game let's go through a rhythm game so it was either parappa or guitar man and i i decided on guitar man uh i've so i've never played guitar man so that's gonna be it's gonna be a good time because people are gonna ask we're playing the original guitar man on a ps2 uh composite cables with our frame meister um so this is gonna be a good time yeah guitar man's only supposed to be like an hour long right um i saw on how long to beat it's listed at like six hours i'm like that's not right i know this song only has like 10 song uh, yeah this game only has like 10 songs 10 or 11 songs there you go. yeah tresk it's uh 9 30 eastern standard time right now so i've never played this game so i i don't really know what i'm getting into uh it's gonna be a good time yeah no i know the screen's off center and i can center it but then i'm covering part of it would you, do you guys prefer it centered, but I'm covering a little bit of it, or off center and I'm not covering a little bit? What do you guys, what do you guys prefer, actually? I have no, I have no clue. And actually, Fish Dot, uh, good thing you bring that up. Um, so the reason I'm playing this, and I'm gonna be playing other stuff, other of these rhythm games, um, other rhythm games like this, I should say, is because they are doing a Kickstarter right now for Project Rap Rabbit, which is made by Innis J, who made this game. And Nana Onsha, who made Parappa and a bunch of other good rhythm games. You guys like Center? Okay, cool. That's no problem. That's no problem. That's no problem. No problem. But I can like, I can even push him away that gray a little bit. Look at that. I can trim the top and bottom gray too. This is so authentic. Up on. They still shine bright. They still light my way. Oh, that's great. What a cute intro. So I've never played this game, but I heard it I heard it's fairly difficult. Oh, it's pronounced Gitaru Man? Is that right? I always thought it was Gitaru Man. It's too loud? Okay, I'll I'll bump the volume down. Let me know if that volume's okay. Always thought it was Guitaru Man. Let me just pull off some of that gray. Damn it. Okay. Uh, options. Yeah, Matt, I hear that uh, LA Noir playthrough is going super good. Uh, vibration on. Stereo. So should I play on hard or should I play on normal? What do you guys what do you guys want me to play? This is blind. This is blind playthrough. But I can do it on I can I can do it on hard. I can finish it on hard tonight. But only if you guys want me to. Alright, well I can see the majority of votes are on hard. No, they're they're clearly on normal. So let's let's do hard. I I don't know how hard this game is. But like seriously, I I will back out. I will back out if we need to cuz I actually do want to finish it tonight. I actually really do want to finish it tonight. So if I if I need to back out, I'll I'll back out. Nom 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 nom. You won. Kanzi been pecking on you again? You're really like totally useless, aren't you? Yo, this has a great dub. Oh, shut up, Puma. <laughs> but you won. There's something you can do about it, I think. Come on, let's go. Give it a shot. Huh? Are? That's my Oh, that's my guitar tutorial. Of course, that's what that's for. Kimi 
so yeah, you you use the stick and you press buttons, right? That's that's the the thing. I'm kind of familiar with the gameplay, I think. Yeah, there we go. You know, I'm really excited for Project Rap Rabbit, mainly because like nobody else makes like story-based rhythm games, kind of like these guys do. So like, I really hope it succeeds. Because their, their gameplay sounds really novel. It's a lot more like actual rapping than Parappa. Okay, I see. Oh, and it kind of locks you onto it a little bit. Okay. So if you want to go off the line, you actually have to like pull pretty hard. Yeah, Space Channel 5 is real good. It's super basic, but... Yeah, I mean, Parappa's definitely like... Or, or Parappa. Patapon's definitely like... A story-based rhythm game, in a sense, but like... Um... It's not really the same kind of thing, where it's like cutscenes in a big music world, kind of. I, I love Patapon, but like... The specific aesthetic you get in stuff like Parappa and Elite Beat Agents, and clearly this game, hasn't been mimicked by anyone. So... Okay. All right, I'll do it. Oh yeah, this must have been a pain on the PSP. It still kind of makes sense as a port though, because it's like that was the first handheld console with a stick, so it's kind of cool to play like a such a stick-based game on the go. Have I played a wind on? Boy, have I played a wind on! A wind on two is one of my favorite games. I adore a wind on. And as soon as I inject those NDS files onto the Wii U, we're gonna we're gonna fucking do a wind on as well. You better believe. Holy shit! What am I getting into? Ah. In attack mode, lay down the hottest rifts you can. The better you play, the more damage your opponent takes. Mess up, and you're the one who takes damage. In guard mode, the key is to dodge your opponent's attacks. Okay, so that's really like a more traditional rhythm game right there. Push, 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 push. Does this band in the background ever come back, or are they just tutorial? Because they're kind of cute. I imagine they're just tutorial, but hey. Can't have everything. Oh, they're always there? Cool, cool. I looked away from the screen there, so I missed one. I promise I won't look away from the screen in the actual songs. But I needed to know if that band was always there or not. Do I prefer Elite Beat Agents or a Wendon? Um, I like a Wendon 2 better than Elite Beat Agents, but I like Elite Beat Agents better than the first Wendon. There's meaningful improvements to every to each one of those games, so... I like them in reverse order of release. Okay, so that's health. Straight up. Yeah, fucking reset the run. Fuck up the tutorial. Push, push. <laughs> I like this kid. Yeah, Majors, Minors, Majestic March sucked, man. 
two, three. I wasn't looking. <laughs> Oh, I see. If you don't move the stick properly, you miss the note halfway through, okay. This is like an interesting coordination you need. What a fun, like, rhythm system. It's really novel, actually. Oh, fuck that up. Straight up. This is gonna be a great playthrough. We're gonna get through it on hard. No problemo. I'm excited for my confidence and smile to be gone in an hour. Yeah, you're right, the gu guitar is more of a synth than an actual guitar. That's totally true. Yo, this dub is great. Also, these cutscenes are really nice. Like... Oh yeah, is this your least favorite song, John? Dang. Well... Oh, this song is terrible? Really? Fuck. I have so little life, too. What the hell? Is that on, on hard mode? Do you have that little life? Did he not know he could do- yeah, okay. This song doesn't seem terrible so far, but... It's not special either, really, but... Wow. I pressed that too early. This is gonna be a great playthrough. That's really cool how it goes back and forth like that. That's awesome. Enemies have a lot of health, though.
Yo, this game seems really good. <laughs> Gotta say, this game seems real good. So there is a finale, though, after. Okay. Yeah. The tutorial mentioned this, but... Oh, sick. But I got it, whatever. This is dope so far. Uh, I'm... I, I really, really like it. This really reminds me of, like, fucking Oendon and shit. Even, even though, like, their gameplay is so dramatically different and stuff, like, still, the presentation and, like, the unique sense of style... It's awesome. It's dope. So in in hard mode, do you just do you just have that tiny health bar when you start? Is that like what the is that what the deal is, or is that like on normal mode you also only have like a tiny sliver of life? Hard mode is more notes. Oh, the charge phase gives you more health. Ah, okay, I see, I see, I see. Right, right. I just fucked that up. Okay, yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah, I guess I may as well save. Oh, well, if you're offering, I mean. Does Gitaru Man get, get a room man? Does get a room man? Does it have a cool save data icon? Because PS2 had the best save data icons. The 3D models. They were so good. Uh, Lorfi, you can't, you cannot buy this game on Vita, unfortunately. I, I think if you hack your Vita, you can sideload the PSP version. But unfortunately, it's not on PSN, so. You gotta be kidding me. You call that skateboarding? But you one told me he's an awesome The art reminds me of Chulip. Now you won. Remember how easily I tripped you up yesterday? You can't do anything, let alone skateboard. Face it, you'll never succeed. Not in a hundred million years. Well, I will too succeed. Infinity no, impossible. Wait. Maybe not. <laughs> I'm pathetic. <laughs> this dub's amazing. Hey, wait. Hey, that wasn't very nice. Fucking Kazuya. I'd love to do an LP of Chulip. I've never played it. Talent. Guess I'd say that's the spirit that says effort isn't pain but pleasure. What do you say? A hamburger. I wonder if that was what it was in Japanese. These aliens, like, more, well, I guess just thematically remind me of Jumpin' Jack Flash and, uh, uh, Final Countdown? Countdown? No, what was the song and it wasn't Final, it wasn't Countdown. Count oh, Countdown was a one done too. Uh, I forget what it was. I forget the name of the song. The, the, the second to last song in EBA, but... Fucking right in, let's go.
All the bands there, you're right, you're right. You guys didn't lie to me. This song seems really good. This one's faster than the last song. This game's so good. <laughs> I'm just struck by how quality it is. Oops. I don't know why I missed those ones. I guess I fucked up. I like how there's a lot of phrases here, even though it repeats the animations. Like, the song does change up. Oh man, there's a bunch of like little animation sets too. Oh, this song's really good. Ah, the wiggle threw me off. I tried to wiggle too much. This is good. Uh, yeah, uh, Rezo Nartre, you point the stick and you press circle. That's exactly it. You win. <laughs> this is like, it makes me glad that I hadn't played this because I, I didn't know if this game was as good as Owendon and stuff. Uh, I had no idea. And it's, it's totally in the same fucking tier. No problem. And I thought there weren't any games like this left for me. So, 
What the fuck do I know? <laughs> Does that voice want to fuck Gitaru, man? Yes. Absolutely. It's 10 stages? Okay. Yes. Oh, I was on cancel. Ah. <laughs> That'll do it. So, this is the last Gitaru man. By the way, I didn't mention this before. Um, but this was given to me at a meet in LA. Uh, unfortunately, I don't remember whose name it was, but thank you very much for this copy of Gitaru Man. Gitaru. These CG cutscenes are great, by the way. They're really nice. Really high poly characters, lots of nice posts. If you can collect all of the guitars, you'll gain great powers and boom, huh? I have other plans. Huh? I'm gonna practice my skateboarding and Pico's gonna be like, wow, you're so cool. If you live in your dreams, you got no feelings <laughs> you want. Only, only you can use this guitar that's been passed down for generations by the ancestors. The ancestors? Meaning my ancestors? Meaning what? By the way, uh, I've never actually played Buster Groove, Fish Dot. I don't know exactly when I was born, so I'm not exactly the... Look out! Huh? Yo. Nice, we're doing it. Actual black people in Japanese video games. Not just someone whose skin is slightly darker. That's, that's a pet peeve of mine. Would Japanese, like, artists in games just, like, draw an Asian character's skin darker instead of, like, having a black character? I mean, it's, you know, if you want to have a Ganguro character, fine. Man, he really gets bigger, fuck. Yo, all the animals are into it. All the animals feeling the funk. Okay, let's go. That looks like full health to me. Whoops.
Final! Yo, when the phase shifts though, like, I love how distinct each part of the song is. It's so nice. Especially last song with the lyrics. I imagine the lyrics are really hype in every song that have them. Yo, run away! Better run away now! Before I steal your guitar! That's good. That's good. Holy shit, is there a skeleton trio in this game? Is that a real thing? Fuck. Also, is he just dead? <laughs> Did he just die? Is this harder than Project Diva? Uh, so far, no, but I like it better. I, I love Project Diva, I really do. Like, I, I bought every version, including the, the PSP ones. Like, so I've played it for like seven years straight, right? Um, but like, Project Eve is kind of boring as a rhythm game. I mean, it's fun. It's fun. It's enjoyable. But it's just like, play the song, watch the dances. Eh. I really like the aesthetic of stuff like Oendon and Parappa. Um, not so much for their unique styles, but for the whole production, you know? All the characters, the cast, the, the stories told through song. That's what I like. Project Mirai is cool, too. I, li I like Project Eva better, but... Planet Gitaru? Yo, I know nothing about this story. Yeah, I do really like Project Eva, though. Although I do think F second and X were weak, um, do really like them. I don't want to go. No, you can't make me. I don't want to go to Splash Mountain right now. Yo, the voice acting is great. It's not as though fate decrees. Oh, oh, fuck! Everything in life is the consequence of your own acts. Master the waves. It's so good that they have those. Release Ben K. Sir. Oh, Ben K. Oh. Hurry, Gitaro man, hurry! Good question. I wonder how the dog has a spaceship. I mean, he's clearly not a regular dog. He can turn into a fucking robot, but hey. Yo, he starts on the attack. Yeah, it's a different stage structure, this one, because he's on the attack now. Yeah, the stage I can already see is a little more complex rhythmically. Oh fuck, that's a sick riff!
this is just a defense stage. Yo, that was a sick riff, though. It was good. You made it! So that, so that was just like a defense stage. That's fun. That's fun variation. That's, that's really nice that they mixed it up on that stage. And that, that stage has a totally, totally different structure. So that's, that's good. That's nice. Yo, hey, Cranky. You ever played Guitar Man, Cranky? This game's really good. Yeah, Cranky, this is my first time playing it. It's really good. <laughs> Apparently we have a robot. Sure, I'll take it. Any thoughts on the Patapon PS4 remaster? Yeah, it's gonna be tight. It's gonna be good. I heard the Loco Roco remaster was really, really good, so I expect quality. And the and the Parappa one for that matter. Or did I hear the Parappa one was quality? Is the Loco Roco one? Whatever. Parappa one was quality, but Woof amazing. Yo, the band is there! Okay, I, I love this band. And they've got little uh, space helmets on. Oh, that guitar strum. Yo, is this reggae? Yo, is this a reggae track? Oops. Yeah, so this song's the tutorial for big, long notes. Wow, I got, like, no life for this song. Fuck me. Because I missed one of the two notes. Yeah, this is the fucking tutorial for long notes. Go fuck yourself if you can't land them. Fuck me, this could take a while. Oh, we got another charge phase! Oh! Oh, now they're mixing it up. Now I don't know what's happening. Yo, now we got storytelling through rhythm. Fuck. That's the long notes are tricky. I wish you could actually see the direction your stick was pointing in, because it locks onto the lines really hard. Like, and when it's locked onto the lines, you can't see exactly the direction you're pointing. But whatever, that's like minor, minor gripe. Ah. 
Yo, more charge phases. Most of my commentary is gonna boil down to eh sounds as I fuck up notes. The long notes are the hardest ones, but it's it's a fun variety. This song's a bit of a drag out compared to the other songs, which makes sense for like a reggae song. Bye now! Yo, get in the planet. Yeah, that's what I want. Short notes. Hit me with the short notes. Let me have the short notes. Not the long notes. Not those. Then give me those. Long notes are tough. I need to get better at the long notes. Murdered. <laughs> you win. So everyone just dies, right? Like... <laughs> oh shit, really? This is a cool guy says, um, the UFO song in English is exclusive to the demo disc and the English version is legit great. So I will look that up on YouTube after. I got no misses though. That's not bad. I got a, that was a no miss because I did start every note. It's true. I did start every note. Hey, we got a full combo. <laughs> I guess that counts as a full combo. That's not a good full combo, but yeah, whatever. I like that generosity and scoring system. There's there's no need to be stringent with your scoring system in a rhythm game. There's, there's no need to be stringent. Be strict when it comes to points, absolutely. But there's no need to be stringent with, like, passing and failing people. That's something I didn't like about Persona 4 Dancing All Night. Its scoring system, or its health system, is so stringent. On hard mode, like, you make two mistakes, you fail the song. Like... Yo, Scrabs just said insert jab at P4D here. He got me. You got me. Predictable. Infinity impossible. You tell your man, you have been warned. 
is it that everywhere we go, the same kind of jerks say the same kind of thing? It's the same guy. That's why Puma. Huh? Puma? To Puma Gataro. I love this dog. Here I am, old timer. Against my will. So where on this rock would you be? Hmm? What now? Whoa! Yo, these voice actors are they're doing it. They're they're doing it. Uh, uh, chill, uh, chill. Uh, hmm? Yo, time for the slow song. Time to slow it down. Hmm? Or not? Am I misreading this? My name's Kira. What are you doing here? I assume we're going to the slow song. Uh, well, I just found this here and uh Can you sit down there? Uh, uh, sure. Acoustic guitaru? Yeah. Oh shit, the Elgato is shitting. The Elgato is shitting. Uh, I'm gonna pause as soon as we get to the level. Because I don't expect I'll be able to pause right now. I'll probably end up skipping the scene. I just came out for a walk to see the moon. But then I heard that. Oh, this. Yeah, somehow I seem to be okay with this thing. You're good. I tried once, but I could never play like that. Nice, super good. Oh yeah, is that true? All the songs have a funny fail state? That's awesome. That's something I really liked about Oendon. And Prappa and etc. I'm um, Jammer Lammy and shit. The fail states are great. Okay, let me fix the Elgato real quick. Because I could see it shitting. Yeah, Rezonarte. Everyone's Elgato does it, apparently. How's the, how's the audio mix? Is that fine, by the way? Is that okay? I assume it's okay. The baby and Um Jammer Lammy. Mm, I don't remember the baby. I played Um Jammer Lammy like maybe seven years ago. So I'm excited to get back to it. That's that's what we'll do after this. Not tonight, but after this we'll do we'll do Um Jammer for sure. Audio's on point, that's what I want. That audio back to where it was. Right there. Let's fix the screen. Bam. 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 You love it. Oh, it's nice. I I really. By the way, I know I've I fucking humble bragged about it in police knots, but I really love the quality the Frame Meister is giving us. It's so authentic. Oh, when you pause it, it makes you try again. Huh, interesting. Oh, so you can't pause during a song without retrying the song? That's nice. That's good. That's some gutsy shit right there. <laughs> no taking breaks. Yeah. Oh, battle right away. Time to kill the girl. Is this song battle all the way? Because I have full health. Is this just going to be a full battle song? It's a nice song though. Ah, gotta scratch my head anyway. That was really annoying. really nice though whoops yeah this song is definitely getting the player accustomed to like making abrupt turns because I think this is the first song in the game where we have 90 degree turns I like how like so far you can pinpoint the lessons in every single song really really easily Nope. 
More than in other rhythm games, too. Like, Owendon and Elipid Agents is not quite so clear. Damn it. I'm just making a lot of mistakes for some reason. I imagine you can still fail if you run out of life, though. Yo, if the audio's out of sync, uh, refre try refreshing the stream. Uh, that should fix it. I'll, I'll wait for a second to make sure everyone has a chance. Um, but I'm pretty sure you should have to refresh the stream. That should fix it. Audio's good? Audio's a-okay? This is good. This is good. That was a good song, though. This is good. <laughs> Get a room, man. <laughs> I like how she had, um, uh, that tune became a little, that little tune became a lullaby, and why? The singer's voice was Honey Love. I like how her little onomatopoeia for sleeping, she had Zeds and she also had Japanese, like, ku characters. Puma? Where's Puma? 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 Uh, uh, Puma, where'd you go? Why'd you leave me? What am I gonna do all by myself? Puma! Whoa, oh, oh. I have you now, Gitaru man. Sir! Puma, what's happened? Where could you have gone? I'm so lonely, Puma. We've been together so long. That's that's why I said I didn't want to come to this stupid place. What? It's moving. Oh. 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 I love this scared kid. Whoa. Yo, the bone men! Hey, guys, ain't it cold with no skin on? <laughs> At last he's come! Welcome to our planet, Gitaru Man. Hey, it's That's you. so cute how he just goes through the bars. I love it. Had. <laughs> Zoe, I'm going to By the way, your friend has been waiting for you. Welcome to the bone zone, yep. Puma! So you dog napped him! It was too easy. You're both such sad. Gitaru man, not this mutt, you can't fight. You creep! Give him a back to me! Go, Sanbon Trio. Sanbone Trio? Is that right? Oh, why is the Elgato like also acting like shit again? Yeah, it's stuttering again. Yeah. Uh. We're all back. Okay, cool. Let's hope let's hope it works out a bit better today. Or now, I should say. Time for the Sambone Trio. Yo, we got three Metadors. Nocturne's got nothing on this. Oh man. I hear that drumming. Just dodge. Oh my god, I don't have much health. Yo, those notes tightened up a little bit. Hey, here we go! And yeah, fuck that old man. Oh, nice! Does that voice want to fuck Guitar Man? Oh. I love how the guitar just plays the right 
the right tones. Oops, missed two notes. This is the... Sorry. This is the fastest progression from defense to attack. It fucked me up a few times where I missed the first note. I like how all the skeletons have a different sound to them. That was the fastest progression of notes in the game so far. Taking a lot of damage. That was bad. That was a really bad last phrase. The dodging sessions were really fun there. Uh, that was really good. This game's this game's difficulty progression is is like really it's very legible, like just playing the songs, um, and it, it like I said before it's really clear what new mechan well what new concepts they're introducing in each song. This is great. It's great. So that was seven. So we're we're making it. We're making it. Next song is the best song along with four others. <laughs> That's funny. Relying on others is like running a three-legged race. You may not realize it, but you aren't even using half your strength. Gitaru man, hero of legend. We have been waiting for this moment for so long and we are all so grateful. Grateful to me? Gosh. We have been freed, but the real battle is just beginning. To save this planet, you must get back all the guitars the enemy has taken. Uh, there are just two left. When they're uh, all collected, a great power will shake the sky. You can't allow Zoe to possess that power. So Guitar Man lives. Did they redo these cutscenes in widescreen? Like, did they re-render them? I know there's some new songs, but like, did these get the the widescreen treatment too? Just two more. That's not true, there's three more. But they think there's only two. Or I only need two more for my guitar, I guess. But then there's the finale finale. Oh, is that what this guy's called? Metal header? I wonder what I wonder what genre it's gonna be. Oh, they're not widescreened on PSP? It's a bummer. Gregorio 3. Oh, this is not Metalhead. 
I know what we're getting into, though. Yo, I remember MSI. So this is gonna be some mashing. We're gonna we're gonna get into some fast notes, I imagine. Okay, I see. Yeah, this this seems like the this feels like the first really demanding song. I didn't get very much health in the charge phase. Really long attack phrases too, it's nice. Oh, we got another charge phrase, okay, good. I think my biggest struggle is with long series of small notes, like just mashing circle. Or not mashing, but rhythmically mashing. I find rhythmically mashing for a song is the hardest on your first playthrough of that song. Like there's some songs in Project Evo where it's like, go fuck yourself if it's your first play on Extreme. You just can't, you can't do that on your first play. Defense time? Whoops. Ah, that was a lot of damage. That was so much damage. It's gonna speed up pretty hard. Fuck, I'm really not happy about that. I've done it again. Ah, I'm really not happy about that. This guy gives 
me the creep! Pull yourself together! Believe in yourself! That, this, this bit fucks me up. This was the bit I did the worst at, I think. Oh no, but then I took big damage at one bit in the middle. These fast notes, that's what gets me. Yeah, I really don't have a lot of life, just like last time. Oh yeah, we have a second charge phrase, that's true. Yeah, this is a slightly more appropriate amount of life. There we go. Okay, let's go. going a little better, I think, overall. Okay, cool. That's good. You hey, Edgar Allan, yo. Glad you liked Psychonauts. That was a heckin' fun LP. Wah! First try. First try, too. That was good. So he just died as well, right? Like, we've just been killing every character, curb-stomping them. 
<laughs> but I'm happy with this. First, second try. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> hmm. Gitano Man, I'm impressed. It seems the legends are true. But I've prepared the stage for the ultimate test. Who's the true ruler of planet Gitaru? It will be decided once and for all here in Gitaru Arena! Oh, yeah. Are we doing a two-phase thing? Where he's going to have two songs? Or is there another guy before him? Zoe, just you wait. You're finished. You're the one who's finished, Gitaru Man. This time you will relinquish your Gitaru to me. Greatest Gravillion warrior, enter. Ah, no. Bummer. It's what's her face. Hi, you. What? Lost your nerve? This girl has been bred since birth to be our mightiest warrior. K Kira. So it's you. Your guitar man. But still, I will have no mercy. None. I am a soldier. Battle is my very destiny. Darn it! Why does it have to be Kira? You won. Even if we don't find, she will. Yo, I gotta say, this story sure doesn't stop to explain things. I'm not surprised that those two characters from the beginning are the ones we're fighting. I mean, the, the story progression is not exactly... It's not exactly War and Peace. <laughs> like, they need to have a story so good in a rhythm game that it, like, shocks you and shakes you so you can't finish the next song. Okay, so now it's a solo battle. That's the natural progression of this game. That makes sense. Ow, I took a lot of damage there. I guess we're gonna get a recharge phrase or something. Or we're just gonna come back with a sick solo. One of the two. E B A E B A E B A E B A E B A E B A E B A E B A That's where this is going. This is good. This is good. Push her off the stage. Play free bird. Whoops. Whoops. Oh my god, I'm fucking up this charge section. Oh, yes, yes. This is the sound, the glorious sound. We've forgotten. 
I love the voice acting mid song. Like the story doesn't stop. Yo, she's just playing with you. Wow, I'm doing bad. I don't know why I did so bad there. I don't know why I did so bad there. I don't know what was happening. I think I, I think I just got thrown off. I think I just got thrown off in my head. I don't know what happened there. That was really bad. Like, no Johns. I'm not mad. But I don't know what happened. I just choked. To be honest, though, I'm happy I'm not playing it on normal. Because I feel like normal would have been too easy. So, what are you going to do? Uh... Neat Lead asks, how is changing the song in the fight fair? <laughs> it's not. It's like abject cheating. Stand up, Gitano Man. Why won't you fight? I I can't. You won! Attacker! I shall finish you! Get up, Gitaro Man! Get up, get up, get up! You won! Stand up! I can't fight Kira! I just can't! Gitaro Man, stand up! Fight! Oh and done! Oh and done. Oh and done. Oh and done.
Again, same spot. My hubris. This is a great, like, what would you call it? Like a power ballad? Just a really good tune. have it just take it yeah power ballad okay yeah that's good <laughs> but he cheated by changing the song mid-fight you're right you're totally right neatly but the power of music was still good <laughs> you are the true yo this what is that like a fake out ending are they trying to fake out an ending there or They didn't say that in the previous songs, did they? You're the true Gitaru man? I don't think. Because I guess we did win the Gitaru man contest. The Love Live Guitar Man contest. You can save us all. Yes. Yes, I know you can. Save the planet, me? That's right, you one. Look at your guitar. The eight legendary guitarists are now together as one. God, you're actually collecting guitarus. I like powers like what? The MacGuffins. The guitaru that God only knows. Paid play jumping Jack Flash. I just finally realized that my music is not for fighting. That's right. Go home, so thank you. Curse you, Gitaru man. Play ready, steady, go. Play Sekai Osubarashi. Silence yourself. I to Yabundaze. This is a good cutscene. You couldn't beat me in all of never ending eternity. Why you can do it? So tell me what do you do? I can do it. What? Defeat me? I can. Not you. Can too. You're a loser. Am not. Always made fun of. No way. Always dumb. Back and forth. No. Always failing. No. Failing all things. No. Can't do anything. Yes, I can. So what can you do? I can do it. What you can do? I can do it. What can you do? Show me now. Sure, I can. Miserable scum. Show me all you've got. I can do it. I can. No, you can't. I can. There's no way you can. Yes, I can. You can. Because I can. Because what? Because. Sir, because what? I can do it. Because. Because. Go you. Because I can. Get... Oh, the, the light. The light. <laughs> Yo, this is. This really feels just like that same kind of feel that. Oendon and EVA have at the end. As nuts. 
I, I don't think I've ever seen that form. And I mean, I don't really know any of the songs from the game, so I, I, I'm expecting something cool. Wow, this scenery too. Having a like big scrolling landscape in a PS2 game is demanding. Okay. I'm getting demolished. Tough song. This is, yeah, yeah, by far the tough song. This is good. The last guitar is mine. Now the universe belongs to me. I missed that exact note last time too. Same spot. This was where I fucked up. This riff coming back for all the charge phrases is really nice.
Here we go. Here we fucking go. Yeah! Ah, I missed a lot there. That was bad. That mixed up the rhythm there really hard. Really hard. I didn't I didn't even see the notes. I wasn't ready. <laughs> the last guitar is mine. Fuck, and it was just going to final. That's the that if I'm not mistaken, that was the fastest transition between sequences in this song. So that really threw me off. Hopefully I can do it this time. That was bad, that was bad, that was bad. Hang on, 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 hang on. <laughs> hang on, my sticks. Hang on, my sticks not working anymore. Yeah, my stick's not working. I don't know what just happened. <laughs> like, I can't resume, but my stick just stopped working, so I'm gonna unplug my controller and plug it back in. I don't know what happened there. My controller's not working. Not like this! Okay, yeah, there we go, there we go, there we go. Oh. I got really nervous there. I wasn't, I was, 
I was too busy thinking about the controller being broken. <laughs> Sorry. Okay, okay. This time I'll win. Man, the song's really different this time. Holy shit. I love the RNG in this game, how it, like, changes up the notes. Really smart. This is a bad run. My con no, no, my stick just stopped. My stick stopped again. Did you, did you guys see that at the end? It was pointing the wrong direction? D fuck! Oh no! The last guitar is mine. Oh, shit. My stick's stuck again. Uh-oh, this might be bad. Now my con- yeah, now it's doing it again, or my controller's just not working at all. Is the cable... damaged somewhere? I- I can't even pause right now. It I do I don't have a spare PS2 oh, controller. This is my yeah. only PS2 controller. I think, I think, maybe, maybe, maybe I have another one. I can go check. Let me, let me check if I have another PS2 controller. It's possible that I have another PS2 controller. Another controller here, let's see if this let's see if this one works. This one's a third party controller. And I don't know if Yeah shit, it doesn't I was trying to use this. The D-pad unfortunately does not count as a stick. This is really bad. This is possibly the worst thing. This is possibly the worst thing that could have happened. I'm gonna have to try to clutch it out with my only controller. But you know, that might actually explain some of the bits earlier in the game where I wasn't sure why there was some notes not going. I don't... I don't think I have a PS2 stick. Yeah, I don't have a PS2 arcade stick. That might have been why I missed notes earlier. Okay, well, it's working now. I'll just try not to touch the controller.
Yeah, this is my submission to the get a room and blind hard mode broken controller category. I believe I'm on world record pace. Also personal best. I can, it's doing it. It's, it's gone. Just there. It died again. <laughs> the last guitar is mine. Now the universe belongs to me. It's, yeah, it's gone again. Yeah, I have no way to tell if it's the port or if it's the controller. And I don't want to give up. Let me look again. Let me look again. I don't. I really don't think I have another controller. But let me look again. Yeah, no. All I have is a res trance vibrator. That's all I have. And like right now this it's not it's not working. Like nothing is working right now. And I don't I'm un, I'm deeply unclear on what what it is. Whether it's the port failing, whether it's I don't I don't have a PS1 controller either.
I don't think console reset's gonna help. God, this situation's ridiculous. This is like fucking near Automata not having online when I need it. Oh, fuck. Damn, that's hard. Damn, that's hard. This is a tough song. 
Now the universe belongs to me. Yeah, the counter on the fucking, the counter over the controller did just go down. I gotta cast Stopka on the clock. Yeah, that's right. I got my Kingdom Hearts shit memorized. This is good. That was that was bad. That was a really bad intro, unfortunately. a long song. the controller was going there but I just played bad. Damn, I'm usually really good at that phrase too, but I felt my soul choke. I felt my thumb choke. <laughs> the last guitar is mine. Now the universe belongs to me. I switched my index finger for the notes and then thumb for the defense. Damn. No. It's not fast enough to move between thumb and index finger. Bummer.
That's what I hate about long bits like that, is if your rhythm's off by just a little bit, you'll hit a bunch, but it's hard to get back on rhythm. I think I did it! Oh, that was tight. Oh, that was too tight. Oh, that was really too tight. That was uncomfortably close. How many notes was that? That felt like a like 700 note song. Look at that, 286 great, 286 good. Now I'm not religious, but when you see something like that, you know someone's looking out at you. Yeah, that's like a 700 note song. Dang. Woo! And the controller didn't give out. And the controller didn't fucking give out. Ah, thank you Game Warden. Man, the controller didn't fucking give out. I'm so proud of you. I gotta, I gotta tell my girlfriend this in the morning, because th this PS2 is her PS2. She brought it, uh, she brought it with her when she moved in. So boy, am I replacing this controller tomorrow. Yeah, I'm gonna wake her up and Shin Goku Satsu her. <laughs> what did you do to this PS2 controller? You didn't even have a trance vibrator. Doesn't take much to turn impossible into I'm possible. That's your dream calling. The heart has wings. I've taken the leap. It's your turn. Ah, to turn impossible into I'm possible. I want to read that in Japanese later. I want to look back at the video and see what that actually said. Yeah, get fucked, asshole. <laughs> ah, it's a fun song. This is good credits. That was a fucking good game. Oh my god, these credits are so blurry, I can barely read them on the TV. It actually looks clearer on my computer for some reason. Yo, that's great. That was a really good game. And I'm, I'm kind of shocked at how in step it is with their other games that I've played um, you know it's just like Kingdom Hearts this is one of those games and, and Psychonauts this is one of those games that I've always heard people saying is a total masterpiece and yeah as far as rhythm games go yeah this is a total masterpiece and this is one of the how many reasons? this is one of the eight reasons that I want Project Rap Rabbit to succeed Seriously, we like I want more rhythm games like this and like those two companies are the only ones who've ever really succeeded at it Yeah, sound shower. We're gonna try master mode right after this. Look at that Innis logo it's So good. Yeah, as Commando Joe says, it's the B.O.B. of rhythm games. Exactly Scrams asks, uh, does it kind of bum you out you're not worse at rhythm games as to make your first runs through these games feel more challenging? Well, I earned it, you know? I used to be bad at rhythm games, and then I... It was it was really Elite Beat Agents and Awendon 2 that were the ones that really did it for me. And, uh, the first Project Diva as well. Um, yeah. Look at, by the way, in case you 
can't see this, Elgato is shitting again, which is crazy. It doesn't usually shit this much, but it's doing it again. I can't exactly pause it, but yeah. If you haven't checked it out, um, and you're comfortable with that kind of thing, by all means, check out Project Rap Rabbit on Kickstarter. Uh, unfortunately, there's not much to see right now, but uh, they said that they're going to be showing off music and concept gameplay over the course of the month. And their goal is to make a game with this kind of world and feel, you know? You got your characters meshed with your music, meshed with your gameplay, meshed with, like, the world around them, and they all interact and shit. So, it was good. Also, I feel very happy that I managed to finish it on hard. I was a little concerned that I'd have to back down super hard. Mineta asks, what's a good starter rhythm game for someone new to the genre? I seriously, seriously recommend uh, Elite Beat Agents or Owendon. And if, if you were to get an Owendon game, get Owendon 2. Um, I would say Elite Beat Agents or Owendon or Project Diva 2nd. Not F second, second on the PSP. I think those are very good starter rhythm games. Um, the the first project Eve is also good, but it's it's very simple. Uh, it's it doesn't have the arrow keys in it. So yeah, time to get the PSP version, right? I think we'll have to swing back for the PSP version. Like maybe next next time we're gonna stream a rhythm game. I'll uh, I'll have I'll have an emulator set up with all the songs unlocked or something. But yeah, Minute, I think those are good starter games. And if you've already played a bunch of rhythm games and you want to play a really good rhythm game, I recommend you go play Super Beat Zonic, because Super Beat Zonic is fucking good. And that's coming out um, on PS4 and Xbox One, like, next month or something. Any rhythm game you could recommend to someone that is a hard rock slash metal elitist? Uh, those aren't really my genres. So off the top of my head, I don't have many recommendations outside of, like, Guitar Hero. Does anyone have any recommendations for those kinds of... For, for... Yeah, Guitar Freaks, that's a good one. Guitar Freaks is a good recommendation for that, yeah. And I guess Drum Mania by association, yeah. Um... So what what is Master's Play, exactly? Oh, the two songs in Guitar PSP come unlocked since they're multiplayer songs, yeah. That's actually something that's really cool about... Oh, yeah, Rocksmith is also quite good. Yeah, if you're into real guitar. Yeah. Oh, I can't even... Can I even go in? Okay. This was something that was really cool about Innis games, was they had, like, unique scenarios in their multiplayer matches, which, which I found was really dope. It seems like these ones... Are these real? Are these, like, uh, unique scenarios as well, or...? Because Awendon has, like, a bunch of unique scenarios for multiplayer mode. Um, and that shit's good. And I'd, be, I'd be interested to see if this has unique scenarios in multiplayer. That was something, that was, a, that was a stretch goal for Project Rap Rabbit, is having unique scenarios for the multiplayer as well. Okay, so this isn't unique scenario, but it's yeah, unique environment for the multiplayer. It's nice. That's fun. I but I did see you guys mention that the PSP version has uh, unique scenarios for uh, some of the multi two of the multiplayer songs or something like that, or if it's two new songs, I should say. Oh wait, I'm on the other side. Oh, that's cool. He's on attack mode and I'm on defense mode. It's super direct. That works really well. Like that just makes sense. That just makes so much sense with this this style of gameplay. That makes this a really compelling multiplayer mode, I think. Because it feels like a real head-to-head -head fight. And it's like visibly really head-to-head -head as well. Yeah, the KOF rhythm game on mobile was good, but unfortunately it's dead now. I think you can still sideload it on Android, but you can't buy it anymore. And even if you have it on your device, you can't download new songs anymore. Wow, I'm actually I'm actually losing. I'm actually losing really hard. Oh, and now we alternate restoring life. He got a lot more notes than I did. What the fuck? 
And I botched a lot more. Oh, but the big notes give you more life, of course, so that's probably dead even. Seems like this multiplayer mode, like these matches could go on for a long time. What would be the worst game series to adapt to a rhythm game? The worst to adapt to a rhythm game? I don't know, man. Probably just something boring like Gears of War, but that might turn out fantastic if it was like all dance or something like that. I don't know. Yeah, I'm, I'm keen to see those scenarios in the PSP version. That'll be fun. Oh, it ends with score, I see. Yeah. Gears of War Dancing All Night might be cool, though. Now that I've said it, I kind of regret it. <laughs> Warhammer 40k. Yeah. <laughs> 12 cutscenes. Dope. Toblo just sent me a link. I'm going to open it. It's on YouTube. I hope it's going to play right away, so... UKSRT, final stage. Yeah, okay. Uh, so, I am terrible at Dance Dance Revolution and at ITG. I am abysmal at those games. I am so awful at them. Uh, and it's just, I wish I was better at them, but I'm, I'm not. Uh, and it, it actually really bums me out. Like, I wish I could be decent at them. Um... Because nobody cares about the rhythm games I like. <laughs> That's not true, but but I'm so bad at Dance Dance Revolution. I, I like my my coordination isn't good enough for that. Oh yeah, this is a cool guy. Feel free to link me to the uh, to the song right now. Actually, I'm gonna head into master mode real quick, but I will click on that link and I'll pause it so we can. Did I just go on master mode? Yeah. Okay. Oh, I have to start at the beginning. Okay, yeah. Oh, hi, baby. This Better send that link quick, because I won't be able to click on it during the song. <laughs> oh, whisper it to me, actually, because then I won't have to click the link. And I'll check it after this song. No More Heroes rhythm game might be dope. Yo, the Senran Kagura rhythm game sucks. <laughs> it's got a great opening video, and there's a few songs that are alright, but most of the songs are just boring and long. So this is hard mode, master mode. So what's the deal in master mode exactly? It's just harder? Okay. You know, honestly, this song's not terrible, but like, I, I, it's good at its point in the game, like as an opener. Going back to it, it's not, you're right, it's not that enjoyable to listen to. But I think like at its point in the game as an opener, it's alright. Oh yeah, my Elgato's fucking up. Enjoy the fucking shit show. Okay. I don't think I'm gonna play through the whole song though. Um. Okay, I can see that it's a lot more complicated right out of the gates, though. Yeah, yeah. Especially in this battle phase, I can I can totally tell that it's um, a lot harder. Oops. Yeah, it's a lot harder. This does feel like the jump from uh, normal to hard in Elite Beat Agents, though. Man, I'm dying. 
Look at me talking about how good I am and how, like, this song's still not that hard, then we die in. Oh, whoops. I think I'm dead on the next mistake. <laughs> Yeah, baby game for babies. Aww, <laughs> Look at me. Look at me. Yeah, it's a big difficulty jump. That's nice. That's nice. I'm probably going to go back to that after. Because it's quite enjoyable. So, I'm going to real quick... Crank down the volume and let's open this. This is a cool guy just sent me what is allegedly an English version of Fly Into Your Heart, which is what? The second song? The one with the UFO? Uh, from Guitar Man Lives, but only in the demo version? Was that right? I think that's what he said. And he wants me to listen to it. And we're going to listen to it because it's Guitar Man time. Tell me if this is too loud. I have my wrong headphones on. I was like, why can't I hear this? Totally the wrong headphones. Okay, so it was English in the PSP version as well? Cool. Oh yeah, it is nice. I need to look up how much this game costs on PSP. On Amazon. Oh, that's about what I expected. Well, it's not so bad on PSP. Yeah, this is good. Let me just let me just pause that one, and let me just go rip MP3. There we go. Copy that URL. There we go. That's it's a really good mix of that song. I'm gonna I'm gonna put that in the I'm gonna put that in the stream songs. <laughs> Come at me, Tecmo Koei. Dope. That's going right in there. Um, that's super good. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me send. Let me put the link in the chat so you guys can also see it. Um, because he whispered it to me. I think. I think an ad just opened on my computer. Closed. There we go. This is the. This is the link to the song. I didn't steal nothing. I didn't. I didn't hit download. No, 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 I didn't hit download. I put it in listen to YouTube, but I didn't actually hit the download button. I'm gonna buy the CD. For one song for my stream. <laughs> um, <laughs> um, yeah, uh, so that game was super fucking good. Uh, no two ways around it. I really, really dug it. Um, the controller snafu was something. Let me say, uh, but otherwise that that worked just fine. I gotta replace this controller tomorrow uh, because shit, that's gotta happen. So I guess I want to ask you guys um, for some for some feedback here. Let me just let me go grab the stack of rhythm games. So I want to do all these rhythm games, all these ones. Uh, let me open up my schedule. We might have to, we might have to do like two in a day if we want to crank them out. So the thing is, of course, Police Knots is getting ripped from the schedule because it's it's just not ready to go. Uh, 
Anima... Anima is gonna continue. But that means we have at least, like, four slots in the schedule that need replacing. And we need to get through all these rhythm meetings. So, the list... They come in sets, of course. Is, uh, Parappa, Umjammer Lamy, and Parappa 2. Which I'll do on PS4, PS4, and, uh... I'll probably play this PS1 version, because the... the, the PS3 emulation is not that great. Um, and then the other one, the other set is uh, Vib Ribbon and uh, Rhyme Rider Kirori Khan. Uh, excuse the green screen murdering the box. Uh, but Vib Ribbon and Rhyme Rider Kirori Khan um, is another set of two. And then Owendan EBA and Owendan 2, which I have to uh, get onto the Wii U, which should be doable. Um, what what would you guys, what would you guys want me to start with, uh, like out of the, of the three sets? Because I'm gonna do them in order. I'm gonna play them from in order of release, through the sets. Um, show the Guitar Man CD on green screen again. Uh, when I when I get it out of the PS2 at the end, I'll I'll do that. But I'm gonna leave it on for amb ambiance. Yeah, Vib Ribbon's not fun to watch. Uh, straight up, for Vib Ribbon and for Rhyme Rider, I'm gonna do... They're gonna be very short. I'm not gonna... Like, I'm not gonna play a lot of Vib Ribbon. I don't... I, I love the way Vib Ribbon looks, but I don't adore playing Vib Ribbon either. Okay. We got a lot of Parappa. I, Parappa's definitely winning first place. So I think I'm gonna go Parappa, then Vib Ribbon, Karori Khan, then Owendan. Apologies to all you Owendan voters, but I wanna put... One of the hype ones at the beginning, one of the hype ones at the end. So you guys don't just fucking give up on Vib Ribbon and Kirori Khan. So, <laughs> yeah. Um, okay, so we'll Parappa and then Rhyme Rider and oh, went down. Uh Rhyme Rider and Vib Ribbon. Um, for any, yeah, for anyone, I guess I'll, I'll, I'll let you guys know a bit about Kirori Khan because not many people know about it. It's a Wonder Swan Pocket Color game. Uh, Wonder Swan Pocket Color, Wonder Swan Color game. Uh, it was only ever on Wonder Swan. The reason I'm bundling it with Vibribbon is this game is just like another Vibribbon game. Um, you can't load your own songs in it, unfortunately. And I think it only has four songs in the first place. But it's just another Vibribbon, and it was by Nana Onsha. Um, and it's very unique. Uh, I'm actually, like, it's, I'm holding myself back right now because even the box is incredibly unique. Uh, and I can't wait to show you guys why it is. Um, that's my that's my that's my bait for you guys to come back. Uh, it's really cool, and it's not just unique because the green screen dies. She's she's wearing a frog suit, which is why it freaks out there. Like she's got this frog outfit that you totally can't see. Um, yo, major minor, yo, major minor sucks, man. <laughs> it sucks. What was the rhythm game that came installed on the OG Vita? Do you mean on on the PSP? Do you mean maybe Beats on the PSP? Came installed on the OG Vita. I don't know about one that came installed on it. I don't know. It's a good question. I have no clue. Because um, Beats was pretty good on the PSP. That was an alright game, actually. I wish I wish that had. Uh, yeah, the PSP should retroactively be called the OG Vita. I totally agree, Manita. That's a good line. That's a good line. Um, yo, is Busta Groove good? That's one that I've always ignored. And not like Guitaru Man, like I'll get around to it. But like Busta Groove, I always just ignored. I always just went, eh. Not that interested. Oh, Busta Groove looks cool. What the fuck am I mis mixing this with? I'm mixing this with Busta Move. Yo, this looks cool. I should order that. I should buy Busta Groove. <laughs> Dope. A lot of recommendations there. I should try that. Do you know the game Before the Echo? Before the Echo. A rhythm game? Echo. Oh, on Steam, I see. Oof. Can't say I really like the look of it. Um, it's neat, though. A lot of RPG, ele oh, a lot of RPG elements in there. It's, uh, yeah, I mean, it's neat. That's neat. Maybe I'll try it one time if it ever goes on sale, but not super my aesthetic. Uh, 
How about Boogie? Oh, Gorilla Hands asked about Boogie. Yeah, that was by that was by EA. That was actually not by Ubisoft. I'm pretty sure. Um, I never I I never played it. That came out at the period in my life when I had the least money. Um, that was actually like besides when I was a child or a baby. That was the period of my life when I was like finishing high school, so my parents weren't really lending me money. And like I kind of had to make do with whatever cash I had, and there was no jobs in my like tiny town. Yeah, no, I remember Boogie, and I remember a couple friends of mine worked like tested and worked on Boogie. I know, I know the UI design. I think I know the UI designer for Boogie. He's a good friend of mine. I'm pretty sure he did the UI design on Boogie. That's um, I have to check that out. Uh, Moby Games. Let's see. Let's see if he's credited for it. No, unfortunately, he's not credited for it. But I, kn I know he told me he did it. So, dang. That sucks. But I know I'm not credited for a bunch of games I actually did work on. Where's Theater of Them? Yeah, I can't say I'm planning to stream Theater of Them. Just to be clear here, by the way, because I see a lot of people throwing out a lot of really good rhythm games in the list, like Rhythm Tengoku and stuff. Uh, the reason we're doing these ones, the reason I want to do these ones specifically, is because the Rap Rabbit Kickstarter is happening right now. And I want... I, I don't think tons of people have played all of these games. I think... I think tons of people have played these games, but not all of them, collectively. And I'd really like to share why these games are so special and why, like, Project Rap Rabbit excites me just about as much as Bloodstained. Uh, because it's... it's the, the, These are the only rhythm games, as far as I know, that really mesh story and rhythm in a, in a fun, engaging way that doesn't just back up to visual novel screen between song like that's that to me is like the cheapest shit um in in a, in a in a sense that i don't i don't like it's not high production value i guess and it's not that i need production value but like we don't get rhythm games with like story production value we, we just don't get that at all um and and rap rabbit i mean the goal is is to make another one of these uh with those big production values um so you know Crossing my fingers, right? Cross my fingers. I'm really hoping when they show music and show their target gameplay and stuff, I'm really hoping that uh, people will be down for that. That being said, if you're if you're if you feel like you're out of Kickstarter because you had some bad experiences, by all means, don't. You know, like that's not it's not there for you anymore if you're not comfortable. For sure, for sure, for sure. I'm not trying to push anyone who's not into it, but you know, I hope you guys can 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 experience <laughs> through me what I feel makes these games really special so um, and I, I can definitely tell by, by a bunch of people in the chat that a, a bunch of people are into all these games although it does seem like nobody else played Kirori Khan but that's fine because it's the worst one <laughs> in fact actually Kirori Khan and Vibribbon actually totally don't have the story stuff going on um, but I just want to do them for the sake of getting Kirori Khan out there and because it's it's like Nana Onsha uh, during the time. Like, I don't want to... Like, because for Innis, for Innis, we get Gitaru Man and we get Owendan. For Nana Onsha, all we get is the Parappa Trilogy. So it's like, oh, uh, I want to give Nana Onsha a bit more than that. So they'll they'll get Vib Ribbon and they'll get, <laughs> and they'll get um, Kirori Khan. Yeah. <laughs> No, I don't expect anyone to have played that. I, I didn't play it until um, the last time I went to Japan. I got a beautiful Wonder Swan crystal. Um, humble brag, I got a Wonder Swan crystal. Um, and I, I played it for the first time, and it really it really surprised me and stuff. Uh, but yeah, man. But yeah, man. Give me Yokai Watch. Oh, fuck. I wish that the Just Dance Yokai Watch game came out in English. I should buy that. I should buy that. Yokai Watch. I wonder how much that would cost to import. It, it, whoa, that's on Wii U though, isn't it? But you can hack your Wii U to be region free, can't you? I should get that. Yeah, for anyone who doesn't know, there is a Just Dance Yokai Watch game for Japan. I think it only has like 10 songs or something. Um, 
And it, it's a Just Dance game. It's made by Ubisoft. Um, let's see, song list. Yeah, but it's only on Wii U, so I'm going to have to hack my... Let's check this shit out. I'm, I'm putting on a video so we can just, like, cut through the songs real quick. Oh, let me mute the... Actually, let me just turn this, turn this kit off. I'm pretty sure the anime openings are in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, let's let's go. We got the trailer open. Let's just let's just listen to these songs. Yeah, it did not sell that well, unfortunately. Okay, here we go. Just dance trailer. You guys get to listen along with me, so please adjust your headset. Okay, here's all the songs. Okay, okay. We got Gera Gera Po. The song everyone wants. There we go. Yokai, I forget what this song's called. This one's fucking fantastic. This is just like a lot of mixes of that. <laughs> dan Dan Tobispa. I don't remember this one. Or is this the second ending? Is that what it was? Get up, get up, get up, dance to Torin. Get up, get up, get up. This feels like it's all mixes of the same song. And this is one of the Nye KB songs. I don't know, uh, one yan yan no, I can't read that kanji. That's, that's the full that's the full set list. It's like 11 tracks. It's tiny. Yeah, shit. I should uh I should I should look into importing that. That's going to that's not going to be cheap, man. And I have to hack my Wii. U. I have to hack my Wii U anyway cuz I want to I want to get a Wendon and EBA going. So, yeah. Mm, okay, well it's it's 12:10 in the AM. Fuck, holy shit. Uh, again, apologies for not streaming Anima tonight. Uh, we're we're going to get we're gonna get right back on Anima. ASAP. Yo, a JoJo rhythm game would be super fun. Um, oh, it'd be great if they had a rhythm game that was just 4chan four, four choruses. Those are great. I love the uh, City Escape one. Get up, get up. So... Shoutouts to Sir Pike Chips, Aussie Mandia 555, Recruit B10, Savage Engine, BV728, Halo Wood X, Laxine, and Limited Time Gamer for their subscriptions. And thanks to Bear for his donation. He says, thanks for the entertainment. A little heart at the beginning for good measure. And th thank you for the donation. Um, and again, to anyone who donated bits, um, I did catch some of those in the chat. Uh, and thank you guys very much for the donations. Unfortunately, uh, for some reason, Streamlabs has stopped tracking them for me. I don't know why. Apparently, it's not happening to other people, but I just I can't see that shit. Taiko Drum Master when? Um, when the, you know what? When the Switch version of Taiko Drum Master comes out, play some Taiko Drum Master. Taiko Taiko's a drum ma a game that I wish I was better at. I'm not terrible at it, but like like I'm not DDR terrible, but like I'm only about as good as I am at like Project Diva. I, I get overwhelmed in uh, in um, Taiko really hard when I'm playing it with buttons, especially. Uh, I, I I actually do better on the arcade cabinets at like conventions and shit, but it's um. I mean, I'm not at conventions that often, so <laughs> what are you gonna do, right? Uh, and yeah, cause I was I was asked. I think I showed this off last time where I was like, oh look at this awesome Guitaru Man disc. Um, so give me one sec, and I'll show you this awesome Guitaru Man disc. 
this awesome Guitar Man disc. Look at that. Hang on, let me... I can't see my own stream. This awesome Guitar Man disc. Check that shit out. Look at that. There he is. <laughs> it looks so good. It's actually pretty dope seeing it, like, completely clear like that. God, technology's amazing, isn't it? Look at this incredible technology. It looks really cool. I don't think any of the other, like, Parappa... Parappa's orange. Parappa's aggressive orange. Purchased from La Boutique Jeux Vidéo. Oh, but the frog disappears, of course. Um, Jammer Lammy's black. Yeah, um, Jammer Lammy's got, like, a nice record going on. Yeah. It's about what I expected. Yeah, Subject G, I believe there's a couple Toho tracks and a couple of um, Taiko Drum Master games. In fact, I think the, yeah, the one that came out on Vita, you can import because the Vita is not region locked, and I believe it does have Toho tracks in it. I believe. They may have only been DLC, but I think there was at least one or two that weren't DLC, so, hey. Uh, yeah. Anyway, uh, I'll be back on tomorrow. Tomorrow we're going to play Anima. I know the schedule says otherwise. I'm going to update the schedule tomorrow or something um, to remove police knots and shit. Uh, tomorrow we're going to be back on with Am Anima. And then on the 23rd, possibly, we'll do Parappa. I don't know. I don't know what we're gonna do for Parappa, so I'm just gonna like label them as like rhythm. Well, no, you know what? I should put the specific things. I don't know what we're gonna do for Parappa. Like we might, uh, we might finish two of them or something. I don't think we'll finish all three games. That's a lot. But maybe we'll finish two of them. Uh, Anima tomorrow will be at 1 p.m. Yeah, uh, I, I, just like on the schedule. I'm gonna try to keep the times the same on the schedule. So. When's the Tyco game for Vita LP? Eh. <laughs> uh, never. I'll play it when the Switch version comes out. When the Switch version comes out. That much I can give you, for sure. Will I do Parappa mode in Lamy? You know what? I've never done Parappa mode in Lamy. So Lamy has a full, like, Lamy game. But you can switch to Parappa. But I think it's like, you have to, you have to beat the game to unlock it, right? And I, I won't be playing it with my save file, so I think that you, you do have to finish it, right, to unlock Parappa stuff? Yeah, that is. Oh, that is the case? Okay, yeah. Uh, does the manual say anything about it? What's what's the detail? It's, it's New Game Plus, right? Yeah, okay, yeah. I see someone actually literally saying New Game Plus right there. Um... Yeah, there's no info on it in the manual. But yeah, I do have to finish the game. So I don't... Is it... Is, is Does Parappa Mode add, like, uh, meaningful content to it? Or is it is it just the same songs? Oh, I guess it's the same songs, but Parappa also sings. Is that is that also... Um, what, what the deal is? Is that pretty much what the deal is? Yo, karaoke stream? Fuck that. I, I don't think I can sing very well at all. I think I'm pretty bad, actually. So, Whatever, play Jade Cocoon. I, I would never say never to it, but it's not high on my list. If I was going to play a PS1 RPG that I've never played, I'd go to uh, Legend of Dragoon first, because I've never played Legend of Dragoon, so that seems like it'd be cool. Um, I, I, I'd be interested to stream the Patapon remaster when it comes out, uh, although, like, doing all three... I don't know if I'd do all three games. It's a lot. It's a lot to do. Right now, I, I want to focus on, like, finishing the series that we kind of started. So, like, I want to do Kingdom Hearts. I want to get through all the Kingdom Hearts, starting, like, starting back up in June with Chain of Memories and then continuing forward. Um... I want to do all these rhythm games, then card game month. Like, we're, we're, we're fucking packed right now, actually. And I think there was another... Yeah, now that we're doing Anima Gate of Memories, we've also got to do the WiiWare Anima to finish that out. Um, but I want, I want to, like, yeah, wrap up some stuff, too. 
I hear Patapon 3 is simple, but it's like, you have to, yeah, okay, there we go, you have to grind a lot, yeah, that's what Toblo's saying right there. Um, I've, I've, I've never played the third one, actually. It, it came about at a point in my life when I was second most destitute, and I just, it just went right past me, so. The intro is really good, so. Yeah, it's good. Play the world ends with you. I mean, you know, if I can get the Wii U set up to play DS ROMs, then you know it's a thing we can think about. So, you know, yeah. Anyway, uh, I'm gonna take off for the night, for the morning. It's twelve eighteen in the morning. Good morning. Um, play audio surf with Parappa music. Eh. Uh, anyway, so uh, I'll see you guys later. Thanks very much for tuning in as usual. Uh, thanks to everyone who subbed and donated and etc. and and bid it all over me. Is that what that is? You bit all over someone? Maybe. I guess so. I think that was that meme, right? The guy, he hits the button, it says bit on it or something like that. So that was pretty cool. Uh, anyway, I'll see you guys tomorrow for Anima. And then whenever the next date was. Hopefully, I'll, I'll, I'll try to have a new schedule up tomorrow. Uh, thank you all for cheering me on through Guitar Man. Uh, that was a super good time. So anyway, uh, take care of yourselves. Have a good one. And, uh, and good night. Or good morning. Whichever you celebrate, I won't criticize. <laughs>